All eyes on one man in a rich vein of form and topping the scoring charts. Will he add more today on EA TV? Hello and welcome to the northeast of England. We're here at St James's Park. I'm Derek Ray and sitting next to me with his tactics charts at the ready is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Newcastle United and they take on Fulham. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. And now they get the ball rolling. Shelby. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. And good use of advantage. The referee allowing play to continue. Well, Newcastle United can boast the number one attack in the league. You can't argue with that. Well, their attacking play has been brilliant. They're always looking to pass it forward. The wide... Now, hold on, Stuart. They're in here. And foiled only by the crossbar. Obvious offside. under some pressure could be in it goes an early goal no wonder they're celebrating well here's the replay and he's got to clear his lines there he doesn't do that he has his pocket picked and he's been rightly punished. Poor defending. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? This is looking threatening. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw in. Wilson. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. And saved by the keeper. Playing it short. Cross could be useful. And well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. Getting forward. how to do it inside your own penalty area Tapsoba Guimaraes Shelby 
And the referee spotted the foul but has played advantage. But it didn't end up being a significant advantage. And so a free kick here. It comes to nothing in the end. And the referee is quite rightly letting it go. Superb block. And getting close to the half-time interval, it's Newcastle in front. Stuart, interested to get your assessment so far. Well, I think they've been the better side in oh, this Oh, they game. could be in here, Stuart. Oh, couldn't beat the goalkeeper. And really should have been able to. Oh, managing to beat him. Really good high press. Cleared away comprehensively. Well, he went strongly in for the challenge, and the result is a throw-in. What about the stoppage time situation? Two minutes the word. Untidy in possession. And Newcastle using width to good effect. And that's it. We've reached the halfway point here at St. James's Park. So the second half is underway. Newcastle United have the lead, but this is a long way from being settled. Well, attacking possibilities. Newcastle will get the throw in. Not a great pass. Can he convert? Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. <laughs> Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, as a defender, that will sit you down to the ground. Oh, the angle was acute. Well, I don't think anybody was expecting him to shoot from there. That was really close. Don't forget, we have more live action from the Premier League coming up. Oh, he's through on goal here, Derek. Increases the advantage to two. Just what they wanted and just what they deserve. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it. And it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. So back underway with the scoreline standing at 2-0. Shelby. Well, there it is. Newcastle just haven't had as much of the ball, but when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. That's very effective. Good high pressing. Pereira. Palinha. Promising attack, this. And that puts them in position. 
Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Well, this is the home of live football, EA TV, and we have more action coming up from the Premier League for you. It's Fulham facing Tottenham Hotspur. That should be a tasty encounter. Plenty of quality in those two sides. Certainly one to enjoy. And a goal! There he is at the double. They just can't subdue him. Well, as you can see, he's a dangerous runner with the ball. He has such good balance and pace. That's a top-class goal, isn't it? This is looking rather comfortable for them. 3 0. Number 24, Miguel Amron. Just 15 minutes remaining. Number 10, Alan Maximo. And now passing it through. No problems grabbing hold of that one. Throw in for Fulham. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Palinha. Fulham unable to retain possession. And a tidy challenge. And the referee has deemed that an additional four minutes are in order. Getting forward. And the referee takes exception to the challenge. Free kick. Well, that could be the final warning. Well, he needs to be careful now. Next foul, and it's a card. And there goes the final whistle and the final outcome, a victory for the Magpies. What did you make of it? Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively, almost cutting through at will at times. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest.